Hi friends, it's Chasing Creativity. Thank you for joining me today. I am making an embellishment book for my, uh, the YouTube Hop, Cats Haunted, a Halloween Haunted YouTube Hop. Um, and I'm part of that. I'm completely honored, so I'm extremely happy. And I, I love the ladies. It's been great, a great learning experience. And one of the things that I'm learning is that I'm learning actually how to make different stuff. Now, I love mini books, but unless I put them in the ring, like those big fat rings, I tend not to make them because I can't get the Peak Valley thing. Anyway, it's always wrong. I, I, I always glue something together. It's a mess. So uh, I was uh, watching Craft Purge and Crafting with Liller, um, who is my best friend, one of my great friends. And I was truly inspired. Now, I do have the embellishments to go in it already. Um, but I thought I would just make the cover really, really nice. So, I started going through both of theirs. I, I had both of theirs kind of flopping back and forth. And I just wanted to show you how nice and crisp this is. And, and I, I did the... Um, scoring the way they said to do the scoring the way uh, Tony said to do the scoring and then I um, opened it up on the inside and I measured and I did the scoring and I totally get it like this is fab you're gonna open it and I'm gonna make have pockets here and I'm gonna add the embellishments and it's gonna be great now it's the pastelloween and I know you guys already are all over this and it's just that I'm doing um it's all pastel colors and I love I am typically not a lover of pastels but I'm you know what I'm eating my words because I absolutely love them okay so I wanted to show you the progress. I made this book last night using Martha's glue, glue Crack. Now you guys know that is the best glue. Uh, it's the best adhesive, I love it. I also use two-sided tape. Um, Miss Tony or Miss Crapper, her name is Tony. She recommended or how she did it was she uses the two-sided tape and some um, adhesive, liquid adhesive. Well, she's got that glitter glue and I don't. So I thought in the middle of the night I was doing this and I thought, okay, well, I'll just, just do a little bit at the top and, uh, you know, we'll just kind of play around with it. And, uh, yeah, it was an epic fail because, uh, I figured this isn't such a bad deal. I know you can see the residue, um, but it's going to be covered. So I was like, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with this part being, um, you know, needing to be covered. Now this is 110 cardstock. That is a huge deal, guys. You have to make sure you use the 110. And I should have put another sheet of 110 in here to make it super sturdy. I didn't, but this is the first time I'm really trying to do this. So um, I saw Tony's book and I really wanted to make that um, pocket to where, you know, you pull things out. Well, guys, look what I did. I put my pocket in <laughs> the glue. I guess it ran, uh, my glue runneth over and, uh, it sealed my entire pocket together. So that was a fail. I don't know. I, this is, this is funny to me. I don't know. Um, if it would have been done right, I guess it would have been good, but nonetheless, it, I needed to redo it anyway because of the glue and if you can see there um it's uneven and i'm an esthetician so everything has to be you know aesthetically pleasing um and of course it looks uneven right here and and that's an easy hide because you know you can put ribbon or once you decorate it they're not going to be looking at the lines that's just my thing um and then you turn the page okay so then um i turned the page over and i did another pocket and this one is at the top. Now this one seemed to work, but the glue still, it was still really like tight. So this one has barely any room to open and this one has, but it, so I haven't figured out, I may keep this just as my study book or, or guidebook or something. So then I turned the page and I didn't put anything on this. And then if you open in the middle, you'll see I, I worked really hard on my seaming and this is, this is actually, you can hear it. It's a uh, pretty, it, it, it adhered pretty well. So what I did was I covered the entirety um, of all three layers in double-sided tape and liquid adhesive, right? So that 
you know, the first, uh, this is all an epic fail. I don't have no idea what I'm gonna do with that. But, uh, so I wanted to show you the, my progress. I added, I ended up adding this pocket and I think it came out really good. As you can see, apparently I did something right with the adhesive, but it all, it opened and it, and it, and it did right. And I had the little, so you can kind of see a little bit. I had, sorry guys, I need a different, I need a different camera holder. So anyways, um, so this part looks great. <laughs> so my, my last couple of pages are wonderful. And the first page is an epic fail, but I got this far. I'm super excited. I'm gonna try it again today. And I just wanted to show you guys uh, my progress. I thought it was fun and funny. Um, and apparently I need to use like a thinner nozzle or maybe I'll use a paint. I haven't figured it out because I don't have a, a teeny tiny nozzle. So I'm uh, gonna do what I can. Uh, so if you guys have any idea what I can use to um, kind of have the glue not come out gushing, let me know. Um, so this is it. Thank you guys for joining me today. If you have not subscribed, please hit the subscribe button. If you like what you uh, saw or if, you, or if you're laughing along with me, then I ask that you please make sure that you um, hit the thumbs up and Hit the bell if you like, uh, I'm sorry, hit the bell to be notified of my new uploads. And I am trying to get better, guys, so bear with me. I appreciate you all, and uh, I'm going to figure this thing out. And I may come back later today or tomorrow, and I'll show you my layout. So, uh, once again, uh, you know, just be careful with the adhesive, because I think this book was really promising. Uh, maybe just not this page, so... I don't know if Tony or Lily have any suggestions. Please reach out to me. I love you guys, and um, I will see you next time. Talk to you later. Bye.